Do you have a hard time knowing when is the right time to get to the grocery store or get those groceries into your house? In this video, I want to share with you what has worked for our family of six. Today, I want to go through my process for meal planning, meal prepping, and just organizing all and staying on a budget because as a family of six, things can add up very quickly. The first thing I do is I go through my pantry. What I'm going to be doing is pretty much going through every single thing. We've had some different events that have had a lot of leftover snacks and whatnot. And you can see this is evidence of uh, kids. This is like the kids section. So it's a little less organized because it's the littles getting their own food items and whatnot. Um, then we have the bulk item. So I'm going to go through my pantry and I'm going to just take everything out, make sure what needs to be removed, like disposed of is disposed of, what needs to be used is used. And then I'm going to meal plan based off of what I have in my pantry. And here is my refrigerator. I have two refrigerators. So this is like current foods that we're working on. And then my second refrigerator has like overhaul. So what I always do, what I do is I make sure that I look and see, um, you know, what do I have that needs to be used so that I can make meals, plan meals off of what we currently have and I can use. And then I also uh, check my outside frit refrigerator to see what needs to be brought in. I'm always in a state of like circulating things so that that way uh, things don't go to waste. I, I'm, I don't love things going to waste and that's a super helpful way not to uh, waste money and stay on a budget. There was a time when I found going to the grocery store on Tuesdays was super awesome. But I also found that by the end of the week, we were running low and then it caused for us to eat out more over the weekend. So I personally find that Friday or Saturday morning is what fits best for our family. So throughout the week, I will be gathering ideas, usually starting like Wednesday or Thursday of what the family wants to eat, what we're running low on, tips on that are on previous videos kind of start working up what we're going to order i do go into the store uh, if i if i can avoid it i do uh, do online ordering uh, but i do go into the store for costco i do a monthly costco haul and then i do uh rotating between a walmart grocery pickup and then we have heb here locally and they just have some really really good branded food options that we like to rotate having so we'll say on a four week month we'll say week one is costco week two is heb week three is walmart week four is heb something like that we have specific staples that we like from each individual place Obviously for Costco, make sure that it's within the budget and then actually do my Costco uh, trip that coincides with the pay period that allows for a larger grocery budget because Costco obviously, ching ching. They encourage you to plan your trip on uh, a Friday, Saturday, if you absolutely must on a Sunday, we just try to preserve our rest day as our Sundays. Get to that grocery store. In my previous videos, I've encouraged you about making a meal plan and um, sticking to that plan. The really neat thing about doing online ordering is that you're able to kind of work up your shopping list throughout the week once you've decided where you're gonna shop at. If you're going to go into the store, absolutely make sure you have that list. And I, especially when I'm going into the store, I like to make sure that I give some wiggle room for sh sale items, clearance items. Always take advantage of whether you're shopping online or you're shopping in the store, look at the clearance items.